Hey guys, Jeff here from the CC Mentor channel here on YouTube. And I wanted to just make a really quick video. I'm literally like getting ready to run out the door. We're taking our puppy for his first, one of his first big hikes and maybe going down to the beach. But after I posted my video yesterday on the BNB steak, I had several people reach out to me and also make comments uh, talking about how do you get set up to be able to use BNB in MetaMask. So um, once again, you know, our team has great resources. So I'm not going to go through that whole process myself. I'm just going to share a video here with you. But one of the big things right now about getting connected with BNB on your MetaMask is there's going to be a lot of new opportunities because of, um, and Mike's going to go into this too, and, and so is Robin. But um, one, of the, one of the situations right now with Ethereum, which, you know, we love Ethereum, but the gas prices have gotten so high, it's getting a little challenging sometimes. So you're seeing new things come out on the BNB smart chain. So there's like two steps to this process in order to be able to use BNB. So there's gonna be a really cool new thing we're gonna be announcing very soon, but then we talked about BNB stake. We've got the peak project, which starts with BNB and then transfers to peak. So you'll need to understand how to get BNB into your MetaMask wallet. And if, well, it's really a two-step process. So this is going to be the first step. The first step is getting your MetaMask wallet set up so that you can have, be on the Binance Smart Chain. So that's going to be the first step. And then the next step is going to be to set up your uh, Binance uh, Smart Wallet, Binance Chain Wallet, sorry. It's an extension on Chrome and Firefox, just like MetaMask is. So you kind of have to do this two-step process. You go, first, you get your BNB from wherever you get it. And I'll give you a link to you know, crypto.com or wherever. Um, some of you already have it. Some of you use Binance, some of you on Binance US, wherever you have to get your BNB, start with that. It's got to go into the Binance chain wallet and then convert from there over to the MetaMask wallet. It's a two-step process. You don't want to get it wrong. Your, your crypto is out there in the ether someplace. So I'm not going to, to spend any time explaining it right here. Um, go through step one here if you know how to, if you don't know how to do that. And then uh, in the next video, we'll talk about the next step, which is moving into the Binance Chain Wallet and back over to MetaMask. So hopefully that makes sense. Uh, if you like the content here, of course, as always, hit that thumbs up, you know, like, subscribe, do everything, you know, the routine, guys. So um, if you want to see the video I made yesterday about BNB Stake, where it's producing some really significant returns right now in BNB for staking, uh, check that out. I'll actually link it down in the description below. It's also the video I did just previous to this one. So check that out. And if you have any questions, drop them in the comments, or I also give you a way to reach out to me directly through Facebook Messenger. So my link is in the comments below, or not the comments, but my link is in the description below, sorry. So, all right, you guys have a great day. Uh, I'm gonna go out and enjoy the beautiful weather on this Sunday, spend some time with my girl and my dog, and I will catch you guys on the next video for step two. So CC Mentor out, talk to you soon. Hey guys, so in just a moment, Robin's gonna come in here and show you step-by-step -step how to set everything up so you can use BNB with your MetaMask wallet, which allows you to interact with all the opportunities out there coming up in the cryptocurrency industry that require BNB. That's on the Binance Smart Chain Network. So this was all new to me recently. It may be new to you as well. You might only be used to using Ethereum, right? Well, Ethereum is just one network. And as a lot of you know, at least right now, the gas fees, the transaction fees with Ethereum is really, really high, not with BNB. So there'll be a lot of smart contracts, a lot of opportunities that use BNB instead of Ethereum to do transactions. So you're gonna wanna get your MetaMask wallet set up on the Binance Smart Chain Network so you can take advantage of these a lot of these opportunities. So this is step one, the first step. Uh, Robin's gonna show you how to set up your MetaMask wallet so you have the Binance Smart Chain on there, and that's the first step to being able to get BNB there. There's more steps. This is the first one. She's going to walk you through it. All right, here we are at step one. If you did not already watch the video above under the here's your step-by-step -step getting started with Peak DeFi, if you didn't watch this intro video, please do that now before you move forward. Again, don't go to your referrer's affiliate link until the very last step. And also be sure you are on your device that has the MetaMask extension, likely that's Google Chrome. So we're in step number one now, and this is where we are setting up your MetaMask Binance Smart Chain Network inside of MetaMask. It's a very simple step. Some of you may already have done this, and if so, 
please continue on to the next video. What we're going to do is we are going to go over to MetaMask and it's right up here in our extension in Google Chrome. Okay. So what you're going to see here is it says BNB Smart Chain because I had set this up already. So when you click this area here, the down, the drop down, it has networks. Typically, it's going to be on the Ethereum main net, and you're going to see it goes to zero because you're going to need to refresh the page. And then when we go back to MetaMask and the Ethereum network, it should bring us back here. It is to uh, what we have in our in our MetaMask wallets with the Ethereum mainnet. And this is typically what we'll have, the Ethereum mainnet under networks. Now, one of the things we're going to do, and you can do this in a couple of different ways, um, you can click on the avatar circle here, click on settings, scroll down and click networks and then add a network. That's one way. Another way is in this area here, you can click custom RPC and it takes you right there. So there's two ways to get to this step. The information that you need is also right here in the on this web page here. And so again, we're gonna click on the Fox. It's gonna have this drop down, and we're gonna click either on this central area and custom R. PC, or we click the avatar, settings, scroll down, networks, add network. So I just want to let you know there are just different ways to get there. So we have network name, and we are going to just follow along here with network name, BNB Smart Chain Network, BNB Smart Chain Network. The chain uh, underneath, it's uh, the new RPC URL, and that's going to be this one here, bsc-dataseed.binance.org. It's already in my list of networks. It's already telling me that, right? So it's not going to want me to add it again. I'm just following along here with you guys. Chain ID is going to be 56. Current C symbol is BNB. That's what we're importing. And then the Block Explorer URL, we're going to have this one here, the BS. C, Binance Smart Chain, scan.com. And then you are going to click save and then you're going to see the network. So then when that is created, you're then going to click this area here and scroll down to your BNB Smart Chain network and select that. And you also need to make sure that you're uh, creating a different account. So you're going to click plus create account and you're going to create a new account. You can call this BNB network. You can call it, which we're going to be using for peak BNB. You can call it whatever you want and then you're going to click create. Okay. So uh, I want to make sure that you name it, that you, you, you click on the avatar. So you click first on the BNB Smart Chain Network that you just created. Then you click the avatar and you want to create a new account. And then again, I named mine Peak BNB. And then this is going to be my new address. And I just copied it here. So I'm going to click on the BNB Smart Chain Network. Again, I created a new account, which is called Peak BNB for my new Peak BNB setup here. And I'm going to actually copy my new wallet address. Okay. And then when I paste it, I'm going to just save it here for me for later. Um, it's my Peak BNB wallet inside of MetaMask. And it's under the BNB Smart Chain Network. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to send ourselves BNB to MetaMask through the BNB Smart Chain in our new account that we just created here in our wallet underneath, again, underneath the BNB Smart Chain. So be sure that you switch from the Ethereum mainnet to the BNB Smart Chain. So now we are, we are all set up. And what we're going to do is we are going to move on to the next step once you have this all set up. So again, just to recap here, we went in to create a custom RPC. 
we created the network, the BNB Smart Chain Network, okay? We selected that. And then after we selected that, we went to the avatar, clicked to create an account, and we created our own account for Peak BNB. Uh, that's what I named it. Again, you can name it what you want. And then I copied the address, the wallet address, and pasted it for myself here and just made a note and named it for myself, Peak BNB. And that's where we're going to send our BNB moving forward. And there are there are a couple more steps involved before we stake our our peak and get access to peak, but I just wanted to make sure that we covered this step. So now you have your BNB smart chain network in MetaMask, and now you are able and capable of receiving BNB into your MetaMask wallet and hooking that up to start working in the BNB networks. All right, let's go on to the next step.